Hey, what's up, guys? This is Mike from Mike Stand Ten, and I'm going to be doing episode four of my Skyblock Survival series. And uh, sorry, I haven't posted these videos in a while. I had to do some computer stuff, do some computer restarting, but I'm back. Um, I'm using a new program called Preps. Um, I don't have the paid version, so I'm going to have to cut it off after every 30 seconds. And uh, if you didn't notice, I just did it there. So that's going to be a little annoying, but at least I don't have that Bandicam logo on my screen. Still haven't gotten any mobs for some reason, but that's good because I'm not finished with my mob spawner. And that's what I was working on last time I was doing a video, so I will continue on that and uh, put some water in it see how that works and I'm s I'm sorry if it's kinda dark right now but uh, it's a mob spotter, it's supposed to be dark so you probably won't be able to see what I'm gonna be doing very well but apologize for that, there's really nothing I can do so oh, come on I'm just gonna be moving water back and forth I'll probably uh, get back to you when I finish that because my thing's gonna time out again pretty soon. Alright, I'm back and I've been moving water and uh, I'm trying to think. I didn't think ahead on this, but uh, I'm not sure if I need to put signs up around here or something to get the water to flow from there to here more or what. Um, I really don't remember. <laughs> but yeah. So let's get some of this stuff here. Okay, so I want so I want water to flow here to here. I um, might have to put a sign, some signs there, but I'm just gonna place one down without a sign and see what happens. Uh, I haven't made a mob spawn in a long time, or at least not one like this. So let's see what happens. Okay, I know that's not supposed to happen, so I think I'm gonna need some signs. That gives me an opportunity to show an opportunity to show you guys my cool tree farm. I don't know if I you guys saw this in the last video, I can't remember. But I made this little place for my trees. I got I only got four right now. I got a little wall around them. So I'm going to grab some wood real quick for signs. And uh, I'm sorry if the video looks like it's kind of snapping to places occasionally. Because uh, really it is. Because I have to break my, well, my recording breaks after every 30 seconds. So yeah, that's why I might be It sounds kind of funny when I'm talking and all of a sudden stop. That's why. So I'm going to craft some signs. Okay. What do we need for signs? We need planks, some sticks like this. Uh, there, three signs. Cool. Should be all I need for now. Uh, the signs look really nice in this texture pack. Again, everything looks nice. And where are all the mobs at? I don't understand. I, I don't know if there's a glitch or something, but I'm not getting any mobs. Uh, let's see if I'm doing this right. So why don't you go there, and then we put water on top of the sign? Ugh, no. I don't remember how to do this. No, I th think you just put it front. And then the mobs go here. No. Well, it's something like that. I can't remember. Um, I'll just have to go with that. Yeah. Whoa. Oh, these are snowballs. Oh wow. Yeah, for some reason, they made this place in a snowball. So then my water keeps freezing. But yeah. So let's make the mob spawner. 
Oh, and hopefully if you guys, I don't know if you guys will notice, I don't even know if it'll work, but hopefully my audio will be a bit more in sync because I record audio at the same time as the video with this program. Like, I still do uh, when I was using Bandcam, but it does it with the single program. I don't have to use two different programs, for, one for audio and one for video. I, it's just one at the same time, so I don't have to sync it up myself manually. It makes it a lot nicer. And, uh, yeah, I really, I need to move that up. That's what I need to do. Swim. Come on. Swim. Wait, that's one. Um, I think one should, but maybe not because the signs are still there. Um, jeez, I, I don't, I really don't know. Uh, mobs need to float through here. Get in this water. Huh. To be honest, I really don't really don't remember how it's done. Something like this. And it just makes them float over here. Maybe they'll walk towards me. And I'll just be transported down here and into the lava. Maybe. Do 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 I'm singing beautifully. So I guess I'll put a sign here. Maybe. Should I? I have an idea. I could put this here. I need more signs, but I have an idea. No. Well, I don't want to do that. <laughs> Come on. Okay. Signs. Yes. I made way too many sticks. I thought they took two sticks. They only take one for three, so that's pretty sweet. Okay. I'm sick of having it time out on me. Like, I, I keep having to restart it though. Like, you probably noticed just there that I kind of skipped ahead a little bit. But, that's the consequences of having a free program. But I do plan on buying it and I'm also getting a new uh, headset. It'll have a really nice mic on it. So my voice will sound all nice and pretty. Oh wow, I just realized my way, my uh, stuff is on. I should probably disable that. It's probably annoying you guys. Um, disabled. Disabled. Sorry about that. <laughs> I use that a lot in my modded survival world. So let's go back here. And it probably just skipped ahead there. But. Oh well. So I will go in here, then the mobs will go down here. And I need more water. I not make that jump? I, I never really done much parkour, but I'm sure if I did some actual downloaded parkour, I would suck at it. <laughs> Jumping in Minecraft is just so... I don't know. It, it just doesn't work for me. Oh, God. Okay, so this right here is what I'm trying to avoid. Actually, that works. Holy crap. Maybe I'm not trying to avoid that. But I will need to move that out a little, I think. Um, actually, no, I will have signs there. So just let me get one more bucket of water. 
hate it how it freezes like that. Why'd they have to make this in a winter biome? So, let's see. This goes here. Yes, this goes here. Okay. So, this should push the mobs down here like this. And then they will go down here, but there won't be any water here because there will be signs and there will be lava above them. And naturally, when they get to the bottom, they'll start jumping like this. And they'll jump into the lava, catch on fire, and die. Oh. That's kind of dangerous. Should probably fix that. Uh oh. No. No. Why is the water going so far? Oh, I sorry, I don't want it to go that far. But, man, I don't know. Let's see. I need more signs. Yeah, this video is just, just gonna be me pretty much working on my mob spawner. Isn't that what every, uh, every skyblock survival video is? Someone working on their mob spawner. And I, I have no idea how long this video is gonna be now because I don't have my timer with this new program. I don't know how many 30 second chunks I've done. <laughs> It's like as soon as uh as soon like my frames will be red while I'm recording and then they'll turn yellow when it's done recording. Like as soon as it's done recording I press the record key again. Just like I did there. And uh I'm gonna have to put some light there right next to the spawner so this water doesn't melt. That's a concern. Because water does melt now if this is not a snow biome. That makes things a little challenging. Will it melt inside the spawner? Because that would just screw everything up. Well, it doesn't seem to be. You know what? What if I did that? Put a sign there and put water there. I think that would work. A lot better, but I want to get this part done first. Come on. I had to put some torches there right next to the mob spawner. Really don't want to put torches by my mob spawner, but whatever. Whoa. Okay. No. <sighs> Alright. Okay, it's her night time. Maybe some mobs will spawn? I don't know if I'm having a good glitch or what, but they just haven't been spawning. I'll probably make a sword just in case they do spawn. Last thing I need is to get pushed off, even though... Then again, I am in... Uh, I had to quit the hardcore mode because I died that one time. But I don't know. Hopefully they'll start spawning. I should probably put some walls around it, so if they do spawn in there and they go down here, then they won't be able to get to me and kill me. So, let's do that. Okay. I don't know, maybe if I, like, go... Maybe into the nether and come back, it'll be some mobs and start spawning. I don't know. Sorry about that creaking noise. That's my chair. Alright, so that should keep mobs out. I'm gonna need to place torches there. I don't have any. Also, I'll need to make it to where I can get up there. And I'm out of cobble. Sweet. Do I have any more? No. 
time so let's take a mining cobble let me think I'm gonna need more cobble for this so uh I'm going to go ahead and stop the video and see how long this is, and if it's around 10 minutes, I'll just cut it and upload that, and then episode 5 will sorry, episode five will be me uh, putting in the lava part and attaching a, uh, what is it, oh, the lava part and a cobblestone spawner to my mom's spawner. So yeah, uh, I'll see you guys next time. And uh, video isn't long <laughs> if the video isn't long enough, then I will be back. If I can figure this out.